The Business Confucius Institute at the University of Leeds was established in November 2012 in partnership with the University of International Business and Economics in Beijing as a non-profit educational organization. The Institute aims to develop educational collaboration between China and the UK and support the expansion of Chinese language education. It's one of only five business-focused institutes in Europe. The Business Confucius Institute has been a great addition to the University of Leeds. It builds on a great tradition here, a tradition that's seeped in Chinese culture and Chinese language, something that we've been interested in at the university for more than 50 years. But the Business Confucius Institute adds to this. It adds a new dimension. It enables us to reach out to the wider community in China and indeed to our own community in the UK. It helps us make business links and it helps us make good, strong economic partnerships. The University of International Business and Economics in Beijing is a tremendously important partner to us a partner that allows us to think together about the great issues facing the world. A, a partnership that enables us to work hard to tackle the issues facing global business. The highly experienced and talented management team is responsible for the successful running of the Institute. Professor Peter Buckley, OBE, is Director of the Institute. He's also the founding director of world-leading research group the Centre of International Business at the University of Leeds. British Deputy Director Dr Hendrik Voss is a lecturer in international business who's produced many major publications. Dr Bo Wang is the Chinese Deputy Director and Associate Professor at the University of International Business and Economics in Beijing with strong academic credentials in Chinese policies and international relations. Operations manager Ms Ellen Wang is dedicated to the expansion of the Institute, actively contributing to initiatives that promote its objectives. The Institute is first and foremost an academic entity that promotes the development of Chinese language education and expands educational links between the UK and China. To support this, the Institute has developed close ties with the East Asian Studies Department at the University of Leeds. The Institute's core teaching team is Ms. Liang Wei Tsong from Han Ban and overseas volunteers Ms. Ho Mi, Mr. Liu Silong and Ms. Lu Chen. Teaching modules count towards a university degree and range from a basic introduction to a comprehensive understanding of Chinese media. Chinese instructors have delivered more than 30 hours of drill lessons, seminars and workshops to the Chinese Studies program within the East Asian Studies Department. The Institute provides scholarship opportunities and in 2013, Marie Tulloch from the East Asian Studies Department gained an exceptional scholarship from the University of International Business and Economics in Beijing. Four other students received the Confucius Prize in recognition of their mastery of the Chinese language and promotion of Chinese culture. The Institute also supports China Studies students taking part in the annual China Bridge Proficiency Competition for international college students promoting better communication between young people across the world. The Confucius Institute is an official HSK examination centre, offering an internationally recognised qualification in Mandarin. The average pass rate gained during the three tests hosted so far is over 80%. Staff at the University of Leeds can study basic and intermediate level language courses delivered by the Institute at the Logic Center. These are taught by Michelle Wang and include cultural activities such as calligraphy, Tai Chi, the tea ceremony and a dumpling making workshop.
There are also evening courses open to the public, which are divided into six levels and include subjects ranging from pinyin, the Chinese character system, to meeting clients. The institute supports the Bradford Chinese School, the Leeds Chinese Community School and Harrogate Grammar School for the teaching of Mandarin and cultural activities. The relationship between Bradford Chinese School and Business Confucius Institute has been really good. Uh, we have been working with them ever since they established a year ago. Uh, we have been working uh, on four areas. Uh, one is teacher training, which is very important to us. They offered free training to all of our teachers. And they also provided teachers, teaching assistants, and volunteers for our school to support our teaching. They also uh, give us free textbooks and teaching materials, which help us uh, tremendously. Uh, and recently, we, we're quite happy to become one of their teaching spots of Business Confucius Institute in, in Leeds University. Since it opened, the institute has taught 373 students, 205 in East Asian Studies, 24 in Confucius Institute classes, 43 at the Logic Centre and 100 in Chinese community schools. Walk and move. As well as teaching Chinese to students, the institute helps to develop Chinese teachers in 2013, over 50 teachers took part in a teacher training day that looked at innovative teaching methods for language education. The Institute provides general and tailored training courses in Chinese culture and etiquette for businesses interested in investing in China. The Institute has been a great help to me in not only attending events and understanding about the culture and the customs and the things that I need to do to improve my business to help me develop the business in China, but also as a great source of networking from a wide variety of people and organisations. It's fair to say that I think without the Institute and their help, not only the events but also learning the language which they have put on through various classes at all levels, that this has been a great uh, source of inspiration for me to improve my business and to do well in China. Regular activities promote commercial opportunities for Chinese and British businesses and the Institute has already attained close ties with influential investors. In 2013, the first China Luxury Market Seminar, held in line with the UKTI China Luxury Mission, stimulated new partnerships with key stakeholders, such as the China-Britain Business Council, UK Trade and Investment and DLA Piper. In 2014, the Institute was significantly involved in the mission again, supporting one-to-one -one meetings by engaging with luxury local retailers. The event included a welcome dinner at the Northern Ballet, attended by the Chinese delegation and Chinese consulate general, and supported by the Lord Mayor of Leeds. As head of retail for UKTI China, uh, I've been working with uh, Ellen Wang of the Confucius Institute since July last year. Um, the introduction came from Alistair Morgan, our Consul General in Guangzhou, who attended a seminar in May 2003 uh, to talk to local businesses about the luxury market in China, which I helped prepare the presentation. Uh, and so Ellen has been instrumental in the, the, the day that we've organised here to meet with local businesses uh, with a, a luxury buyers delegation that we've brought from China. And uh, so we have 25 very good companies um, who are all looking to offer local Leeds businesses a route into the China market. Uh, what the Confucius Institute have also done, they've added value to our trip by organising a fantastic reception this evening. But also we have a site visit to a local company called Hainsworth tomorrow, um, which I understand make the, uh, the uniforms for the Royal Guards uh, in Buckingham Palace. Um, so that will be a treat for the delegation, but there's also a very good business element to that visit uh, because a number of my delegation will be interested in doing business with Hainsworth. I've just returned from an exciting trip to China. Uh, the aim of the mission, of course, was to attract inward investment to Leeds. And for that to happen, of course, there has to be networks 
there has to be a, an understanding on both sides about what the challenges are within our different ways of doing things, our different cultures. And that's where the Confucius um, Institute steps in. It provides language training, it provides training for businesses so that they're prepared in needs to go to China. The China Business Club began in 2014 to support firms either already dealing with China or interested in doing so. Business breakfasts help with assessment of commercial opportunities and challenges, regional differences and hospitality customs. The annual Yorkshire Chinese New Year Dinner brings together distinguished guests from local government, the Chinese Embassy, local businesses and the University of Leeds. I think the Leeds Convention in the last year has achieved a huge success. 结合了商务研究和汉语教学，呃，开设了很多的课程。我觉得一年的短短的一年里面取得这样的成绩是难能可贵的。呃，我们就祝愿这个栗子孔院在新的一年里面取得更大的进步。The aim of China Britain Business Council is to help British companies do more business in China, and they need to know China from a variety of perspectives. For example, we did some work with Leeds University and the Confucius Institute to understand more about the opportunities in China's regional cities. And this helped China Britain Business Council inform its clients better about the opportunities there. Well, as the uh, largest business law firm in the world, DLA Piper looks to uh, institutions like the Business Confucius Institute to help our clients understand China much better. So we think that the Business Confucius Institute adds real value in terms of knowledge, cutting edge research, um, advice to our clients on what China is doing and, and what uh, it can do for them in the future, which is really important knowledge for our clients when they're looking to um, do business in China, which is sometimes a very difficult environment to, to, to work in. The promotion of Chinese culture is a two-way process. Last year, the Institute's Partnership University in Beijing hosted a summer camp program for University of Leeds students. And in 2014, a youth delegation from China visited the UK. Meet the Authors events give prominent writers such as British Chinese director and grantor selected author Guo Xiao Lu and Professor Wu Da Ming the chance to discuss their publications with other academics, business representatives, and like minded students. Leading Chinese academics have lectured at the University of Leeds, including the former dean of Fu Dan University, Professor Ni Xu Xiong, who discussed China's evolving foreign policy and international aims. The Institute supports student-run events such as Leeds Got Talent, organised by Hong Kong and British-born Chinese student societies, the event showcased the diverse talents of the university's Asian population. Chinese New Year celebrations are excellent for cultural promotion. The Institute co-organises the annual Chinese New Year celebration with the Leeds Chinese Students and Scholars Association held this year at Leeds Town Hall with acrobatics, magic and live musical performances. The first anniversary of the Confucius Institute in November 2013 was celebrated by a week-long series of cultural, business and academic events. These included an exhibition of artwork by renowned Oriental artist Gu Feng and displayed his award-winning portrait of Confucius. Over 5,000 guests attended. Gu Feng also appeared in an East Meets West cross-cultural seminar with British painter Pip Dickens. The International Academic Conference Master in International Business was held in collaboration with the University of International Business and Economics in Beijing. Welcome to the first anniversary of the Business Confucius Institute at the University of Leeds. The celebration week culminated in a sparkling evening of cultural performances, including martial arts, folk songs and dance by members of the Goldsmiths Confucius Institute, together with a live performance by Gu Feng. The achievements of the Business Confucius Institute in Leeds have gained media attention 
In the UK, the Institute has been featured in the Financial Times, Yorkshire Post, Telegraph and Argus, and European Times. In China, it's achieved coverage in Xinhua News, China Daily, and the National Museum of China. Professor Buckley has been interviewed by the BBC and Swedish television network SVT about the role of the Institute. The Business Confucius Institute has already proved successful in strengthening educational and business cooperation between the UK and China. For the future, the Institute looks forward to continuing success and further expansion. The Confucius Institute has built a firm foundation in four key areas. First of all, we have established our language teaching of Mandarin. Secondly, we have conducted a number of outreach activities in the wider community, schools and so on. Thirdly, we have conducted a number of cultural events which have been very successful and led to the entertainment of Leeds. And fourthly, we have built a hub for the meeting together of business, government and university people interested in doing business in China. From this foundation, we now will go on and establish the Confucius Institute at the University of Leeds as the major hub for the meeting of Chinese businesses interested in investing in Europe and European businesses investing in China. And we look forward to further success in those areas. May the friendship between China and Britain last forever. <laughs>